Hi everyone, Helen here. In today's video, I'm going to be trying out Bite Beauty's new Upswing Full Volume Mascara. This is Bite Beauty's first mascara product and it's already labeled as one of the best new products of January 2021 by InStyle Magazine. So I'm super excited to try it out and see how it wears. Ooh, it comes in a girthy, pretty rose gold tube. The wand is gigantic as well. It has an hourglass shape and it reminds me of the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara wand. I'm going to start with my right eye. Just brush the mascara through. This is with one coat of mascara and you can already see that my lashes are longer and darker. I'm going with the second coat here. Here are my lashes with the second coat. Do my second eye here. I have mascara here on both eyes, and the length on this is looking quite insane. I don't usually wear bottom lash mascara, but I did apply some there because that is the best way to test if it is truly smudge resistant, as the box says. It is now 1:02, and I'll check back in a couple of hours. It is now 3.40 and I'm already losing light so quick. It has only been a couple hours since I first applied the mascara but I've already collected enough evidence to prove and refute the claims. To bring you close up here, you can see that the length and the volume from the mascara is still there on my lashes. But if you take a closer look underneath my bottom lash line, there is smudging and flaking. So here we can see the smudging underneath my bottom lash line and a couple of flakes. Same goes for this eye and it's only been a couple of hours. So I'm sure that as I wear it throughout the day and more into the night, there is going to be even more smudging and flaking. My final thoughts on this mascara, I think it works well as a mascara. My lashes do look dramatically different. It is a lot longer and has more volume and is darker. So about half of the claims are there and is proven to be true. As for the rest of the claims, I do not feel that it is curl enhancing. It didn't really do much for my curl. Some of my stray lashes are actually drooping a bit and it is not smudge and flake resistant because as we saw, there is smudging on my uh, lower lash line and there are little flakes that are coming off. I will keep you posted with a photo of what the mascara looks like by the end of the night. That is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Ah! I just jazzed myself in the eye.